Okay guys, I'm gonna show you how I meal prep. Um, I've tried meal prep before and it just doesn't ever seem to come out well or it just doesn't seem to work very well for some reason. So I'm gonna show you kind of how I meal prep. It's maybe a little bit more modified than other meal preps. I only choose three meals to cook for the week. So my husband and I rotate the meals throughout the week. If you are somebody who doesn't like doing that, then this probably isn't a good idea for you. But for me, it works well. Um, so what I do is I plan one meat per meal. So whether it be chicken or pork or whatever. And then I try to add at least two side dishes per meal. And that way during the week, you can rotate the side dishes out with the meat. So even though you are eating relatively the same thing all week long, it doesn't seem that bad because you're rotating the um, the meals around. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to show you guys, um, I, went, I just actually got back from grocery shopping, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got and what I'm gonna make. So I'll show you how I do it and I'm trying to decide. I think what I'm going to do is I'll show you what I have here, what I'm planning on making, and then when it is all finished, I will show you guys the end product. If you guys actually want to see more detail on how I cook things or um, that kind of stuff, I'll show you that as well. But let me know if you want to see that. I figured this is at least a start. And I don't know um, if you guys have tried meal prep and it just doesn't work. It always seemed like I would try it and it never worked well for me. So I've kind of come up with my own version of meal prepping for myself and my family. Um, yeah, so let me show you what I got for this week. All right guys, so let me show you what I have here. I know this is, this is a lot of stuff, but this is three meals. Um, I'm cooking three separate meals, but then I'm also going to be making this into our dinners for the week as well as my husband takes lunches to work every day. So um, I actually go ahead and prepack his lunches in containers as well so that he has five days worth of meals. Um, so I mean, that's quite a bit of food. I, I mean, all fitting on my, my counter here. So let me go through what I'm going to make this week. So the three meals I'm making this week is I'm making... Um, chicken with uh, fried rice. So here's my chicken. I still use organic chicken. I um, tried eating regular chicken and I seem to always get sick. For some reason, my body can't process it. So um, I'm still eating organic chicken. So there's the chicken. This is actually some that was left over from last week. I'm going to marinate it in this. I don't know if you guys have ever tried this. Um, they're pretty good. Let me show you the stats on the back. Um, so you can see, I mean, there's really, there's nothing in it, that really. Um, there is seven grams of sugar for a fourth a cup of this, but I'm actually gonna be um, not even using that much of it for myself. So that's um, the meat of one meal. So with that, I'm also doing stir, or um, yeah, stir fried rice, I guess. So I, this is rice, this is um, jasmine rice that I actually cooked last week, and that's leftover, so I'm gonna be using that. Um, I also, and it's not out here, but I have some frozen peas that I'm gonna add with that. I also have, um, carrots back here. This is all I had left for the past couple of weeks. So I bought a new bag of that. So I'm going to dice those up and put that in with the rice. Um, I'll have some onions. I'll have um, probably some celery. I don't know, just whatever I feel, onions or whatever I feel like putting in there. So um, with the rice, I'm planning on also doing steamed broccoli. So I got these, they're kind of small heads of broccoli um, with the rice and the chicken. So that's meal number one. Meal number two is going to be um, pork, um, baked pork chops. These are boneless pork chops. With that, I'm making a pineapple salsa, which will have pineapple, onions, and uh, cilantro in that to go with it. I haven't decided um, necessarily with that meal what's going to be the other side, but I, I bought these today. These look really good. Um, they're crinkle cut sweet potato fries. So I'm going to bake those in the oven um, and have it with the pork and some other vegetable. Haven't decided. I actually think I might do, I don't know, steamed carrots or something. Um, okay. So then my third meal for the week is going to be um, chili. So I have about a pound and a half of um, ground turkey. So to that, I will add these things over here. So I've got um, diced tomatoes, tomato sauce. I've got three different kinds of beans I'm gonna add. 
And then I'm also going to serve it with collard greens. I love collard greens. Um, so that's what I'm going to have with that. And then the other thing that my husband really, really loves with um, chili is cornbread muffins. But in my cornbread muffins, I put bacon and cheddar, which I'm using Colby Jack cheese today. Um, and those are really, really delicious, guys. So that's what I'm going to make. I also have in the back here um, some of these noodles. They're like a three different colored noodles. And I'm going to make kind of a, a really light pasta salad, um, probably with, um, I'll actually probably add a little bit of bacon in there. Um, yeah, so that's that. I also have strawberries. These I love to cut up and eat during the week. So that's that. Um, what I do to prepare my meals is I basically set everything out like you see here. Um, these bowls, what I do is I go ahead and dice everything that needs to be cut up, everything that needs to be um, prepared. I put them in these bowls and I do that first. And then basically I can just add whatever I want to my meal. So for this meal, there's several dishes that need onions. So I'm going to go ahead and just cut up a whole bunch of onions and use them as I need during the meal. Um, okay, so that's that's what I'm going to be making. I'll show you guys the end product when it's done. Okay, guys, I'm getting close to being done with my meal prep, so I wanted to show you what I have, and then I'll show you my final product. So here are those sweet potato fries. They, they really came out. They're, they're pretty small, but they're good. So I've got my steamed broccoli, my steamed carrots. Here is the pasta salad. It's got a little bit of bacon, um, Italian dressing, and there will be some Parmesan cheese on there later. This is my cilantro and onions. I still need to dice up my um, pineapple for that pineapple salsa. And then let me show you what I have over here. Um, my rice is done. It's kind of stir fried rice. It wasn't ever fried, so, but anyway, that's still what I'm calling it. Here is my big pot of chili. It's gonna be awesome. Here's my chicken. Um, I've got half of it cooked up there. The other bit's going right here. This will be done pretty soon. And then in the oven, I have my pork chops. Ooh, steam. Um, and there are those um, cheddar bacon cornbread muffins. So the, the these are almost done. All right, I'll show you guys the finished product in a little bit. Okay, guys, so here is what an afternoon of cooking does when I'm done. So in this big container, I have chili. This is chicken with that marinade. And this is pork chops with a honey mustard um, marinade. I've got my pasta with bacon. I've got my sort of fried rice. I've got my vegetables. So I've got steamed cat, um, broccoli, steamed carrots. These are collard greens. This is my um, pineapple salsa. These are the sweet potato um, fries. And then here are my cornbread muffins that have the cheddar and bacon in them. And then I wanted to show you guys what my husband's lunches look like. So basically I prepare him a meal like this. So there's the chili, cornbread, and collard greens. This one is the pork chops and a couple of the sides. And then here's the rice, chicken, and a couple of the sides as well. So I've still got two more of them to make for his lunch um, for the week, but I'm, I'm basically done. I just have to wash those containers. So this is what I wanted to show you guys. And this is basically um, a very, very easy way for me to get dinner on the table every single night. Um, and we don't have to eat the same thing if we don't want. And so everything's prepared in their bowls. And then basically you just take what the portion that you want, heat it up, and you've got a really good meal. Um, all of these things last all week long and they still taste as fresh at the end of the week. So I hope you guys liked this. And um, if you're interested, I'll make more of these depending on how my week goes. Um, but I just wanted to say one thing that is really cool about doing it this way is that you basically are using everything you buy. So I used all of my broccoli. Um, I've used, you know, all of the onions I bought and everything like that. So I'm basically using everything and not having to throw anything out at the end of the week. All right, talk to you guys later.